Yeah, sir. Delivering that furniture, as y'all know, I ain't gonna be blow up well. I'm going to be couch London, you know what I'm saying? Because my mattress don't get here until 22nd. I almost said I wasn't going to be blow up bed London no more, but I kind of still am. Because a nigga ain't got no bed, no mattress yet. But that mattress is on the way. Yes, sir. Got my damn couch, no cap. You know what I'm saying? I, don't, I officially don't have to be blow up bed London no more. You feel me? Your boy can now sleep on the couch. Don't get me wrong. I done had some good times on that blow up bed already. Cap. <laughs> Since I've been here, so put your mind together to it till you look like that. Oh! I'm waiting on them to come back because they gotta uh they gotta do something. They got they forgot to screw the shit into my bed and they just gotta bring something back. My mattress don't get here till uh 22nd. So I'm gonna be sleeping on my couch, which I don't care because I'm cool with that. I'm cool sleeping on this big ass couch. I got a section. I ain't gonna show you this shit yet. Till I do the un the furnished house tour i just did the unfurnished that's cool but just know man tv get put on the wall tomorrow it's lit the crib is coming together man and stay tuned for the vlogs man because we going all the way up and then i seen the votes that y'all picked y'all want me to do more vlogs so guess what i'm gonna do more vlogs you know i'm saying I'm, I'm gonna try to make the vlogs more funnier every time I'm, I'm still getting acquainted out here with people and all that eventually i'll have I'm, I'm sure i'll have a little circle and shit but in real life i'm just a to myself type nigga like i don't like too many niggas knowing what i be into or you know what i'm saying because it's just it's less problems less problems when you do it that way and there's less people in your business nah man eventually we'll have a little circle out here i will be making videos with other people right now i'm just trying to get acquainted with, with the area with people alone and yeah we about to go crazy Man, I love y'all. Keep subscribing to the channel, like the video. Let's get on with the vlog because I know it's gonna be another scene after this. No cap, subscribe. Man, 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 I'm about to head to the bank right now so I can get some money orders because I'm about to go put down five months rent right now. No cap, you know what I'm saying? I got the money, so I need to just go do it. You know what I'm saying? You never know when you're gonna run into a hard time. So while you got the money, just do it. Handle your business when you got the money. When you got a lot of money, okay, cool. It's time for playtime, but there's a time for playtime and it's time to be serious. And right now, I done had my playtime. Now it's time to be serious. I really should have put the rent down when I first moved in. You know what I'm saying? But I didn't. But I ain't about to. This is one thing about me. I'm not going to dwell on what I didn't do. You know what I'm saying? I'm just going to make it happen. I'm going to make it right right now. You know what I'm saying? You got to think for right now. Don't think for. What happened yesterday, you gotta think for right now, and that's just, damn, why it's so dark? That's just advice to anybody, you know what I'm saying? You gotta think for right now, don't think for what happened yesterday. Fuck yesterday, it's a new day, be great today. All right, that's done, go up in this motherfucker, give him this rent. Okay, so now that that's uh, out the way, now I gotta find out how to get this money back, you know what I'm saying? Now I gotta grind on YouTube to get my money back, because I just spent, uh, more than a couple thousand dollars uh, paying my rent up, and I don't like spending money. You know what I'm saying? So, for that being said, I gotta find out how to get my racks back because I just spent well over three thousand uh, dollars paying up my rent. You know what I'm saying? So, we got to uh, figure this out right now. No cap, but that's what being a hustler is about, man. You know what I'm saying? Spending it and then knowing how to get it right back. You know what I'm saying? Taking nothing and turning it into something. If you a hustler, which I know all the London gang is hustlers, y'all could do it just like me. No cap. Headed to go get some of them uh, Berea, Baraya tacos, every, every, all them tacos y'all be seeing with the people's dipping it in that juice or whatever. I'm about to go get that, you know what I'm saying? I think that shit is about to be mad good. We about to see though. I want to see how good that shit is, you know what I'm saying? Yes, sir. So I'm downtown Houston right now. I'm in the, I'm in uh, uh, an area they call Galleria. I'm about to go get some food. It's like this area where it's a bunch of food trucks and shit. I'm about to go get them Berea tacos, whatever they, whatever them shit's called, bro. You know what I'm saying? No cap, whatever the fuck that shit is, bro. I don't know what the fuck that shit called or where it's at, but I'm about to find that hoe. Man, I hope I'm at the right place, man. I don't, I don't know if I'm at the. I mean, it's a bunch of food trucks, but where the fuck is the Berea tacos at? Whatever them shit's called. You don't know how mad I am, bro. I just went on my phone and it says that Taco Fugo is closed. I'm wondering why I cannot find the fucking Taco Berea place because the shit is closed, bro. Bro, I just drove 30 minutes. It gotta be another taco spot down here that, that sell Berea. Berea tacos. It got to. I'm about to look it up. Bro, so I'm having a hard time finding a spot, man, right here downtown um, Houston, uh, Westheimer. I should, shouldn't be having this issue because Westheimer is so big and Westheimer is like one of the most popular streets in Houston, man. But I found a place, but it's 30 minutes away and I really wanted something down here so that after I eat, 
I could just take a walk and just vlog, you know what I'm saying, vlog downtown. But you know what? I'm so dedicated at pushing some content out for y'all that I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to travel 30 minutes, all the way 30 minutes, to probably the other side of Houston, and then I'm going to come all the way back down here. So basically, I'm going to travel an hour just for y'all, just so that I can get, keep getting this content out, man. This is for y'all. I do this for y'all. I love y'all, man. Appreciate everybody supporting me, man. We's officially on the road to 100K, man. Let's get there, man. Let's get there. Let's get it. Let go. Bro, I, I nigga, it, I'm heated right now. So, long story short, y'all remember earlier today I went to go pay my rent. You know what I'm saying? I had to go get uh, money orders. So, when she gave me the money orders back, she had a word um, that was spelled correct incorrectly. So, I told her, you know what I'm saying? She had to make a new money order. So, she said, okay, I have to deposit these into your account and then take it out. So, I go to look at my account just to see what's going on. She done took the the she done took some money out my account that was already in my account. She, it's like she never even um, deposited the money. She just took the money out of my account, bro. Like hell nah, bro. I need my money, bro. That shit just pissed me the fuck off, bro. So I'm on the phone with Chase right now, seeing if they could. Well, they better give me my money, but ain't no seeing, bro. Oh my god, I'm in love with Houston women. I swear to God. I am in love with Houston women. No cap, like. Can I get uh, a, a select flavor or is it just like a select? Can I get a different meat or do I choose the meat? Beef? Okay. okay. I don't know what the fuck this shit about to taste like, but. I've been seeing this shit all over the place, and we gonna see some drink. I don't even know what the fuck. I think I'm gonna go ahead and fuck with that lemonade right there. And they got the gin. Let me get, let me get some of this right here. Can I get both of these mixed? Can I, can I mix them? Yeah. Would it be good? You think? And that's lemonade. Let's try it. Let's try it. We're gonna try it. We're gonna try it. You know what I'm saying? We trying new shit on the London's Way channel. You already know how we rock. I got two of them poles, man. Fuck it. Huh? Yeah. First time trying this. Hook, hook me up. Hook me up. Yo, this shit is crazy. Take a look at the... Yo, I don't even know if I'm saying this shit right. I don't know if it's Barika, Maria, Maria, or Sharia. But I got them shits and I'm about to fuck these shits up and y'all about to watch me eat it. No cap. Listen, man. I'm downtown Houston right now. About to try my Berea. Bro, I don't even know if I'm saying this shit right, bro. Barika, Berea. I've been seeing everybody over the net eating this shit, so guess what? I'm about to join the club. This shit is sloppy as fuck, bro. Let's try to eat these shits. Come on. Dip it in the sauce. No cap. That shit is good as fuck. Mm-hmm. I will call this a little mukbang or some shit, right? Man, that shit hit. I'm not gonna lie, that shit hitting different. I just hope I'm not eating pork. I don't eat pork. I'm, if I'm eating pork, hmm, this is some good ass pork. Oh. Right now, I don't even care. I'm not gonna lie, this shit is different, my nigga. This shit is shit spicy as fuck, though. This shit a whole new vibe, I ain't gonna lie. If you're not already subscribed to my reactions channel, go ahead and click the link in the description. Subscribe to my reactions channel, man. We going crazy. I'm dropping on daily reactions every day. Two to three. Probably gonna post my first reaction tomorrow. So make sure you tuned in and make sure you subscribe. Hey, uh, all you see out here is foreign cars, bro. It's so motivating to be out here in Houston. It just makes you want to grind more, man. Grind harder. Yeah, I'm vlogging, nigga. What you keep looking at me for? Like, right, oh, people, you see people with a, with a person with a camera, they just think that it's a sign on my face that say stare at me or some shit. It's not. Stop looking at me, you weird. Today was a good day. My furniture came. I don't got to sleep on a blow up bed no more. I'm not blow up bed London no more. You know what I'm saying? Today was a great day. Trying new foods, man. I'm, I'm loving Houston, man. I'm loving Houston, like it's on a whole nother level. It's like I, like I was saying before, I got really interrupted. It's so motivating out here. All you seeing is successful people, Bentleys, Lambo trucks, Rolls Royce trucks, Rolls Royces, everything. In my city, you would never see none of that. You might see a, a Rolls Royce here and there, like every couple months. You might see one in the town. Somebody rented it. But these niggas out here is having that shit. They is owning this shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm over here fucking this shit. Up. I don't put the lime on that motherfucker. Lizine. Oh shit, that shit done sprayed back on my ass. Almost reminded me of when my girl used to. Oh, can't talk like that. This kid's watching. 
tacos is mad spicy, bro. They're not even tacos. I'm disrespecting. See, I'm disrespecting the city of Houston. They hear me say, calling these just tacos, they gonna get on my ass. Maria, Rika, Rika, Maria, Jamia. Everybody these shits is called, I fuck with them. Like, these shits are so good. Like, I promise to God. Like, no, it's fine, man. It's fine. You all right? How you doing? Good, thank you. Good, good. I'm gonna eat there, but that's pretty good. You should. It's very good. It is. Yeah, you look good, too. Uh, yeah, they got a little bar in there. In case you want to come with me. It's too busy eating. Now. I ain't even really show y'all what they even look like. This shit is fire, bro. Like, I don't know what it is, bro, or what that is, but this shit is hitting on a whole nother level, and I'm not capping. Might as well get the thumbnail while I'm right here. Come on. I'm not gonna lie, man. I'm so proud of myself, man. Like, I'm so proud of myself that I made this move for myself. I didn't care about what nobody said, man. So many people was trying to stop me from making this move, telling me that I need to wait. Maybe I should wait till I get more subscribers. Oh, you need this amount of money. When, when in all in reality, you don't know how much money I have moving here. So how you gonna tell me how much money I need to move? Don't ever let nobody tell you what you can't do, man. They, yo, I always say this in every one of my videos, damn that. People will try to tell you you can't do stuff because they have failed at doing it. Let nobody, I mean nobody tell you what you can't do because you could be great. You can be the next president if you want to be. I think it's time for a girlfriend, y'all. It's time. It's time for a young girlfriend. I'm trying to search. You know what I'm saying? Yes, I'm looking. I might just have to get on Tinder tonight and do my damn thing. Oh, hell no. I need to see what type of baddies is really in my area of Houston. If there's some baddies, I'm definitely going to be on Tinder tonight and I'm definitely going to be beating my meat. I don't, I don't beat the meat now. I don't even know why I said that. Listen, this is what I want y'all to do. I want y'all to go back, right? Like, skip the video back where I just said I'm about to beat my meat. And then fast forward it. Cause I never said that. You know what I'm saying? Between me and you, we don't do that. It's no fat. 200 day challenge, no fat. Hey, man, you hungry? Yeah. You hungry? I am. Come on, man. I saw yours, man. Go ahead and eat, bro. Go ahead and eat, man. Dip it in the sauce, too, bro. Oh, wow. Go ahead and dip it in that sauce, man. That's all you, man. Oh, yeah. Good, right? Real good. That's you, man. We know what somebody... What the fuck? What the fuck? What going through, man? Always be generous. Did you want, did you want the onions or you good? You all set? Man, nigga could have said thank you, but that nigga got his fool and got the fuck away from me. That nigga ain't try to have no conversation with me or nothing. But you know what? I don't care because you never know what a person's going through. You know what I'm saying? Maybe all he needed was just a meal to make his day. You know what I'm saying? Like he didn't ask for no money. He I asked him, was he hungry? He said, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Don't be too prideful, man. Don't be too prideful, man. Always help when you can't help. You know what I'm saying? Don't be one of them niggas who. And I could tell he was hungry and he wasn't just looking for drug money, you know what I'm saying? It's a different, it's a different look, you know what I'm saying? When, when you, if you come from where I'm come from, which is the hood and the streets, you know it did the difference between somebody looking for money and somebody looking for just uh, money for, uh, you know the difference between somebody looking for money for drugs and money for food, you know what I'm saying? Or just because they don't have any money. You know the difference. If you come from where I'm come from, and I come from the hood, come from the streets, bad neighborhood, you know what I'm saying? So I could tell that he really needed it, man. It was my pleasure. All right, so, so I just got done eating them Barica tacos or whatever. Currently downtown Houston and all that. You know what I'm saying? About to go explore the city a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Just walk around, chop it up with y'all. You know, my family, my supporters. You know what I'm saying? I don't call y'all fans. I don't call y'all fans. Y'all my supporters. Y'all my family. You know what I'm saying? Fan is somebody who don't know you, but they love you. Y'all know me, and y'all love me. So it's, it's a little bit of both, you know what I'm saying? But y'all is not fans. I wouldn't even dare. I wouldn't even play with y'all like that, no cap. Hey, yo, I'm not going to lie to y'all. I don't know where I'm going. But if I get lost in my new city, I ain't even mad. I ain't even mad. You know what I'm saying? I get lost. I got GPS. I got a phone. Two of them hoes. One for the hoes and one for the hoes. I ever just, I just hope I do not get lost in this city. I don't care if I get lost, but at the same time, I don't want to get lost. You feel me? Oh shit! Where y'all went? Why y'all? Why y'all hiding up here? 
You got lost too? Shit. Yes, we all getting lost in this bitch. Love it out here. I'm, I'm never moving back to New York. Ever. I mean, not say that before y'all get it fucked up. I would probably move to New York City. Like, get a little condo in New York City, but I would never move back to Rochester. That's one place I'm not moving back to is Rochester. It's over for that. I've already had... I ain't got no change, bro. I got a debit card, bro. You want some? You want something to eat? Come on. Fuck it. Whatever he wanted to eat, I'm paying for it. The same thing I got the other day, it was uh, chili cake queso with chips, and it was a beef. I think it was just a, a, a regular. Chicken. Was it chicken. Was it chicken I get the beef this time? The you taco? the beef? Yes, ma'am. But it's the same thing the other day when I came. No problem, man. Have a nice day. Listen, man. This shit just happened. I don't know, man. Maybe I just got a big heart. I don't know, man. I just, I, maybe I got a big heart. You know what I'm saying? When somebody said they hungry, man. My grandma was the type of person that she wouldn't, this is a little off topic, but it kind of like made me think of my grandma. My grandma would never refuse anybody food. It don't matter who you are, what you what you doing. If you wanted food or you were hungry and you ain't had no clothes on your back, she was gonna give it to you if she had it. You know what I'm saying? So when he asked me for a couple dollars, you know what I'm saying? I said no, you know what I'm saying? But when he said, can you help me get something to eat? You know, I kept it walking, then I thought about like, wait, you want something to eat? Of course I could help you get something to eat, man. You never, like, yo, I don't care, man. Y'all could say I'm a chump. Y'all could say whatever y'all want to say. All I know is I'm helping somebody in need. If you hungry, man, and I see you on the street, and you ask me, I'm not about to open willingly go ahead and ask you if you want something to eat. But if you ask me, can you get me something to eat, I'm going to say yes. You know what I'm saying? Because you never know when the last time somebody ate some food, bro. You just never know. You never know. Yo, it's your boy London, man. I'm back at the crib, man. I literally just woke up from a little nap. I've been sleeping right here on this damn couch, man. It feels so good not to sleep on the blow bed. I'm not blow bed London no more. I'm just me. Um, man, this is the end of the day, man. You know what I'm saying? I had a real busy day. Uh, them, ta them barica tacos was fire. Um, we did a couple things today, man. We got some, we knocked a lot of shit out, man. And, um, yeah, man, I love y'all, man. Stay tuned for another vlog, man. Wait till tomorrow because you know you're going to get another naughty tomorrow. No cap.